Hey friends, are you trying to figure out how to get rid of the Kartra branding on your pages? Here's what I'm talking about specifically. Up here, if you look on the tab, we've got a little Kartra logo, not our own domain logo. So this is called a fave icon. And if you've hosted your website in Kartra, here's how to change that. So I'm gonna go back into Kartra right now. And if you go to the little profile icon here on the right and go all the way down to custom domains, this is where you can change it. So I have two domains. One of them has the fave icon, which is this little flower. And one of them is still showing the Kartra one. So you're just gonna click edit domain let it load for a second and you'll see here on the right, you can change your fave icon there. All you have to do is hover over it, click on the little pencil and then find the actual file on your computer. Click on the file and then it's gonna ask you to crop it. If you're happy with the way that looks, you can do it there. Or if you're like me and you just wanna shrink it down just a little bit, then you can play around with how you want it to look here. All you have to do is hit confirm. It's gonna show here. Sometimes um, the next button doesn't appear and that's just because Kartra wants you to select something or something's been left out. So then you just click next. It's going to tell you that it started. It should complete, completed within a day, but in my experience, changing the fave icon is instant. So I'm going to go back over to that page and hit refresh. So it's not instant yet. Oh, there we go. The new one appeared. Now all of my pages that are on this domain are gonna show that way. If you're a WordPress user and your site is not hosted through Kartra, it's gonna be a different process. So if you're seeing the Kartra logo here and you're using WordPress, just make sure that you're sending your pages with the plugin from Brian. I'll show it to you in a second. Um, you don't wanna use the blank slate plugin because the blank slate plugin will pull the Kartra one, not your WordPress one. So the plugin that I'm referring to is here. So the Kartra pages plugin from Brian, the KCSG, this is the one that you want to use with Kartra. This is a free plugin. Anybody can download it on their WordPress site. Um, I have no affiliation with Brian's company but he's built this for you guys for free. So if you're using the blank slate plugin, you do not get the right fave icon. If you use his plugin, it's gonna pull the one that your WordPress is set to. So as long as you have it set correctly in WordPress, you're gonna get the right one there. But if your site is hosted in Kartra like mine is, then this process is the one that you need to go to. Good luck and have fun with Kartra.